guys! So today I am doing a really fun tutorial for you guys. It is inspired from Cheetah's new music video, My Number, and I fell in love with the makeup from the actual teaser, and the music video is so fun. It's very, uh, catchy, and it's so badass, and I absolutely love her. She's an amazing rapper, and I'm just in love. So I wanted to recreate one of the looks I saw. I might do the second look if you guys want. So let me know in the comments below if you want to see the second look. Which was like a golden smoky eye and like purple lips. So if you want to see that let me know. But um, this one is just a really really dramatic uh, kind of slanted cat eye with lots of blue glitter and black lips. Um, really contoured face and highlight. Um, so I really hope you guys will enjoy this tutorial. If you want to see more, definitely click subscribe. It is free and it means a lot to me. So I hope you guys enjoy it and on with the tutorial. Okay, so first thing, I'm going to apply a base. And I'm just using the e.l.f. smudge pot in Ain't That Sweet. And it's a really shimmery, pinky toned, um, beige. It's pretty much the exact same color as my skin tone. So, I'm just going to apply this all over just to give it a base to stick to and to help prevent creasing. Um, I will definitely do a review on these, um, but so far I'm really liking it. So, the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to draw my outline. And I want to do a very similar kind of kind of uh, angled flat line crease cat eye look. So I'm using the Fergie Wet n Wild gel liner. This is in a little black dress. And I'm just using a uh, the Wet n Wild brush that comes with it. And I'm just going to go ahead and start creating that wing. Now I'm just going to fill it in. I'm going to be using a matte black, and I'm going to be using my trusty, amazing um, Lorac Pro Palette. This is the second version, and I'm taking this black. And I'm just going to use a really fine um, brush from Sedona Lace. And I'm going to take a tissue and kind of lay it up under my eyes so I won't get a bunch of fallout. And I'm just going to take this um, Aurora pencil liner and I'm going to go over just right by my lashes just to make sure it's all seamless and there's no like skin showing. And then uh, do my lower waterline. And my um, upper waterline. And I'm just going to take a little bit of the Milani eyeshadow embellish chiffon. And I'm going to add that on the very center. I mean not center, but the very corner of my eye. Even though we do have the cat eye, I still want to add a little bit of brightness. And you can add a brow highlight if you want to. I'm not going to because I don't want the harsh edges to be gone completely. But um, if you want, you can add a highlight. Um, I would suggest the um, shimmery, like a shimmery champagne color or something like that. 
And now glitter time. I'm using the e.l.f. glitter mascara and this is just the blue one, oh teal. And I'm just going to take a little brush like this and I'm just going to dip it into the mascara and use it as a glitter adhesive. And then going in with J-Cat's uh, Jungle Fever Glitter. I will be adding that right on top. And this is a cosmetics glitter, so you do not have to worry about anything. And I'm going to quickly add some mascara and the rest of my face makeup, and I will be right back. Alright, so the face is done. I just added my foundation, bronzer, and a highlighter. I didn't add any blush because she really doesn't have any blush on. Um, I used a new highlighter, which I'm loving so much. It is the Mary Luminizer from The Balm. Everybody and their mom talks about this, and I really want to get it, and I'm so in love. Um... So, I added some highlighter, you know, just where the sun would hit. And now I'm going to add some black lips. Oh, and I also added some false lashes. I used all my lashes in Desiree. They're really, really kind of dramatic and long. It's kind of hard to tell, but, you know, they're really, really nice. So, I'm going to go ahead and do my lips. Her lips were black in the video, so I'm going to use a black eyeliner and a black lipstick to do my lips. Okay, now since the black isn't dark enough, I'm going to go in with a liquid lipstick. Um, this is dark purple, but it's pretty much black, um, because I don't have a black liquid lipstick. And I'm just going to apply that over. And that is the finished look. I really hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial, and if you did, don't forget to forget to give me a thumbs up and subscribe if you have not. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will talk to all of you later. Bye!